Hello again, this is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery in the backyard. And I've got a pretty pan of colors and I don't want to waste them. So I am going to take my enamel and I think, well, you know what, I really want to do the gold. My dog is dropping a rock at my feet. And I have cleaned all my spatulas. I thought I was done for the day till I looked over and saw that paint. This is an OXO omelet turning spatula. They're available on the Amazon link underneath the link tree link underneath the video. And I'm going to quick like a bunny, hopefully. I didn't grab a... F if you ever have a flaccid canvas, you can take some spray alcohol, rubbing alcohol. Spray the back of it, put it in the sun. Probably works with water too, if you don't have any alcohol. Although, I'm pretty sure everybody's probably got some right about now. <laughs> Something tells me at the beginning of all this. So, what I've got are my pan of colors. And what I want to do is put them down. What am I going to put in there? I'm going to put a bunch of gold in there. And I've got some turquoise metallic iridescent in there. I'm not sure what I'm going to do at all, except for I'm not going to play with you, dog. Not right this second, anyway. Tip that around for a second. Maybe backwards and forwards and see what happens with the patterns. I could put all kinds of other stuff in there. So what I'm thinking is that I'm going to, instead of using my OXO omelet turning spatula, I'm going to use one of my Princeton Art Tool Catalyst spatulas. And I'm going to put some black enamel in there. And then what am I going to do? I'm going to use, am I? Yes, I am. I'm going to use my Venetian blue. From Modern Masters. Flip that over. Bring that over there. Just looking for something really simple right now. Knock that off. I think I'm going to take my other spatula and just drag it down through. And kind of what I want to do is take some of my purple now that I've done this because it's looking a little dark. Or, just continue. Yes, I want some of that purple. And I am going to wipe off my spatula before I do this. When you combine this purple with anything, it's a it's a color shifting purple, so it's going to be blue and purple and all kinds of other colors. And this is playtime. When I got leftovers, all bets are off. I mean, it's not, it's always playtime. <laughs> Don't let me fool you. I was just thinking, I have a new color, which is called Opal Red. It's coming out of the bottle really fast which is too bad because I really didn't want it to. And that's just a really super simple composition. I'm not sure if I want to spiral them out or not. But why not? I'm here, you're here. Plans change. <laughs> Whoa! You know what, dog? You're not helping me at all. Bye-bye. <laughs> that was interesting. All right, I'm going to put a little more. Please go away. Wesley? No, no help from the hubby. A little more of that blue up top. Really tempted to put some green in the bottom. I've got some green to go in the bottom. I have if it'll come out.
So let's do the skewer trick. Just go up and down really casually. Kind of miss the other color green I want to put in there. We'll take all that off of there. Sort of let it fall down and cover the bottom, which I can cover with black. And there we go. Pretty simple. It is what it is. Some nice cells. My paint pouring recipe is underneath the video in the description. The Linktree link has Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links, my Teespring clothing store. You can see the pictures of that underneath the video. If you share my videos, you help me out and I really appreciate it. Almost as much as the beautiful comments you leave me and the thumbs up are really appreciated. If you share my videos to Pinterest or to Facebook, you definitely help me out. I, I think I want some of that other color. And it's not the turquoise and it's right there. And I could definitely, I could hope for a long time. No, I could definitely use some, something else. So wherever I put it, I can then share it with another place. So I don't need to put it all in one spot. This is a lot like other things I've done, but I like those other things I've done. So I'm pretty happy to do them again. And I would normally probably try and spiral out those purple parts, but I like them the way they are. So I'll be touching up my edges after you guys go. Am I going to look at this? I am. Dark turquoise. Ooh, yeah, okay. Just add a little drama up high. Beautiful colors. That's an iridescent turquoise. And in just a minute, my dog's going to have someone to play with him. But not right now, dog. <laughs> he's just staring a hole in my leg. Actually, he's probably looking at his rock. He brought it with him. All right, so I love you guys. There's 86,700 today. I made a bunch of videos today, so you'll probably hear that more than once. Any paint that I've got hanging around is going to go right on here. I used up all of my leftover paint, and I am happy about it. And I love you guys. <laughs> and I think I said that like four times now. Where's my crib sheet? There it is. Check the Amazon link underneath the video on the link tree for the spatulas and for all kinds of other good stuff. If you shop there, it's at no added cost to you. And it helps me out a lot eventually when enough people go there. I have two books. One is called Because I Can and the other one is right next to it. It's volume two. It's called Unlimited Possibilities. They are both... 100 videos and the descriptions and the tools and the processes, techniques, whatever you want to call them, from the first 200 videos that I made for YouTube. And I will see you guys anon. This is Priscilla Batzel in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. Scene. I'm glad you joined me. Thank you. Check the community board and Facebook group Expressionist Art Studio Gallery Appreciation for students for tomorrow's videos. And you guys have a good one. Take care of yourselves and take care of each other. Bye for now. Priscilla out.